Hello guys, Keeper on TV, I'm back for yet another video. Before we get into this video, let's see if we can get 50 likes, and if you haven't already, make sure to drop a sub. So, Birmingham City are linked with a sensational return for that of Mateo Sarkic. Now, Mateo Sarkic, of course, um, did really well at Blues in the couple of months that he was here at the club, um, keeping 10 clean sheets. Of course, he um, made his debut in the pre-season friendly um, last season um, against Northampton where he made that horrendous error and when we signed him on a loan until the end of the season back then I was like oh god but he's proved me massive he's massively proved me wrong um, and um, apparently um, we want to sign him on a permanent basis this summer not a loan deal on a permanent basis Championship out of Birmingham City want to recruit Mateo Sarkic on a permanent basis, but Wolverhampton Wanderers are unwilling to sell him. So that's a big blow um, for um, our pursuit of Mateo Sarkic. Now, he's got one year left on his contract, so signing him, I don't really think it would be too much of an issue. If we get the takeover done, I think we could easily get this deal over the line. Um, now, a lot of people are saying that well, not a lot. I've seen a couple of people say that um, Mateo Sarkic, they don't want they don't want him back at the club, which I think is crazy because when Mateo Sarkic was in goal for Blues, he was outstanding. He was, you know, performing so well. And um, yeah, when he um, was in goal, I was really confident. I was really confident with him in goal because he was a really good shot stopper and his distribution as well was really good. I remember the goal was scored against Cardiff at St Andrews where he just pinged the ball like 80 yards up the pitch and we scored um, off that. It landed to McGree and then he um, laid off Troy Deeney. But Neil Leverage has been our number one goalkeeper since Mateo Sarkic got that injury. And I do feel sorry in a way for Neil Leverage. He's had a lot of setbacks. He's had that injury he suffered against Nottingham Forest. He's had um, COVID-19 as well. And it took a long time for him to recover. But he's not really been the goalkeeper that I expected him to be at Blues. Um, his first season, he did well. I mean, he was really good in his first season. I think his um, setbacks and that have affected his um, performances this uh, season. Last season, I, I remember the, when we played Brentford away, 0-0 draw. He was making like four or five saves a game. Um, when we first signed him as well, I was really happy with the signing. I thought... Yeah, but let's be honest, there was a reason why he was a backup goalkeeper at Cardiff City before we bought him. Yes, he'd done well in the Premier League for Cardiff and got them in the Premier League in the first place, but I think his distribution, I struggle to say that word, I don't know why, is a bit poor. It's been really poor, hasn't it? And um, he's not been the same, um, like I said, since um, getting them set back. So, Matteo Sarkic, you know what the saying, you got, the saying is, you've got to start from the back. And I think this will be a brilliant signing for Blues. I'll be really excited. Um, the foundations have to be built at the back. Starting with the goalkeeper, I do think we need a new goalkeeper. Don't get me wrong, Neil Leverage is a good goalkeeper. He's a brilliant choice as a backup, but as a first choice goalkeeper for next season, I'm just looking at it like I think Mateo Sarkic keeping 10 clean sheets in only like a couple of months being here. Um, the saves he was pulling off uh, this season as well. I do think that, um, yeah, he should be our number one goalkeeper and Blue should be doing all they can to bring him back to St Andrews. Let me know in the comments down below. Do you want Mateo Sarkic back at the club? And uh, do you think that he should be, I mean, is it really a question? He should be number one choice, 100% in my opinion. But let's see if we can hit 50 likes. Like I said, it's been keeping on to you. Make sure to like, share and also subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching, guys. Keep on top.